Hi, welcome to Northern Tier. My name's Keith and I'm going to show you how to stay warm in the winter using our hoop pick sleeping system. The sleeping system will keep you warm in degrees down to negative 30, no matter if you're in a snow shelter or you're sleeping out under the stars. Now I'm from Texas and if I can stay warm in this weather, so can you. Alright, so let's talk about our setup here. Pretty basic, on the bottom you just have a plain old tarp. On top of the tarp, you'll see that we have placed two pads here. Uh, now these are closed cell phone pads. Uh, they'll just keep you a little bit warmer than the uh, open air mattresses that a lot of people use to go hiking with. On top of the pads, we have two sleeping bags. Um, now depending on the weather, you want to decide whether you want maybe a fleece liner, a summer bag, or maybe a zero degree bag inside of your outer bag. Because um, you don't want to get too warm or too cold at night. On the outside we have a negative 20 bag and this will keep you warm in degrees that are down to negative 30 degrees Fahrenheit or so. Um, what else you can do is if you have something like this, we call it a kneeling pad to stand, stand or sit on during the day. Uh, you can tuck this maybe under your head or under your feet, uh, which is especially important for tall guys like myself. So set up your sleep system sometime during the day so you can see what you're doing. Then about an hour before you go to bed, here's what you're going to do. First of all, you're going to grab your water bottle, which you filled with hot water, and you're going to throw that in your inner sleeping bag. I like to tuck it down by the feet, keep my feet a little bit warmer, and what this is going to do is, just like an oven, it's going to start heating up your bag. Also inside, I'm going to put my long underwear that I'm going to wear to bed. Try to get that a little bit warmer before we go to bed with the water bottle. Cover it up. The last thing that is really important is that your sleeping bag does not warm you up you warm your sleeping bag up. So before you go to bed, make sure and do some physical activity, like go on a hike, or play some kickball. All right, so now we're all warmed up, ready to get in our sleeping bag. The name of this game is doing it quick and efficiently. What you want to do is start with your wind layer. Both wind layers actually, not just your top. Stick your wind layers in between your pads. Make sure they're kind of flat so you're not too uncomfortable. That'll help keep them there. Now everything else is gonna go inside your sleeping bags with you. Uh, this is because you've accumulated some moisture during the day uh, and you don't want your clothes to freeze at night. So before I do that, I'll take my boots off. Show you what to do with these guys. Now any boot that you are using out here should have an inner layer. These have gotten really wet at night, so you're going to keep these either in between your legs or inside your armpits. Keeping them close to your body will help them dry out at night. The outsides though, the most important thing you want to remember with these is to keep this part flat, not folded. Put this between your two layers with the boot in sticking next to your hips. And what this will do is prevent you from rolling off of your sleeping bag at night uh, because there is nothing more uncomfortable than waking up freezing cold because you've rolled off your pads. Now what you want to do is take off your warm layers, your fleeces, your flannels, your wools, anything like that. Put these in between your two sleeping bags unless they're pretty wet. Um, then you want to put it inside your inner sleeping bag to help it dry out more at night. What I'm doing is I'm spreading them out pretty evenly around my body. This will help keep me a little bit more comfortable and help them dry out better. Get the second one here. There. Here. All right. Now once I'm inside my sleeping bag, I'm going to go ahead and change my base layer. I'll move around while I'm doing it, some yoga, uh, some push-ups to get warm and warm up my sleeping bag. And that's the basic setup. So my sleeping bag system is set up. I've exercised so I'm warm. I put my wet clothes next to my body to warm up at night. Zipped up my bag, cinched up my mummy. Now I'm ready to go to bed. Good luck and stay warm.